Hi, fourth graders. Today, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about numbers and place value. If you look at a number, for example, 8,543, where each digit is in the number is very important. It tells its place value. For example, the three is in the ones column. So we know that this three actually has a value of three. Now, if we move over, the four is actually in the tens place. So the value of it is not four, but actually 40. When we move over to the hundreds place, we see that we have a five, meaning that we have a value of 500. And finally, all the way over here, we have the thousands place with an eight there, meaning we have 8,000. Now we can manipulate numbers in our mind if we know what these place values mean. For example, if I am looking at the number 8,543 and I want to know what number is one more, well, I'll go to the ones place, which is a three, and if I'm looking for more, I'm going to bring it up one. So one more would get me to 8,000, 544. What if I wanted to do 10 less? I'd go to the tens place where I have a four and less means I would have to go down. So I wanna go down a 10, which would bring me to three tens. So my number would be 8,533. What if I wanted to go all the way over into the hundreds? I know I have 500 right now, but what if I wanted to find what number would be 100 more? Well, 100 more than that would bring that 500 up to 600. So we have 8,643. And finally, we have 1,000 less. Well, we have 8,000 now, 1,000 less would bring us to 7,543. So by knowing what these different values are, we can figure these answers out without having to write out the addition and subtraction problem. I am going to present my screen to you for just a minute because I'd like to show you what your assignment is going to be on Seesaw. If you go to Seesaw under your activities, you're going to find place value, addition, and subtraction. I'd like you to add a response and find your name. I'm going to pick sample student. For this activity, what you need to do is to look at the numbers and find what is one more? What would be 10 more? What would be 100 more? What would be 1,000 more? For these numbers, what would be one less, 10 less, 100 less, 1,000 less? The way that you can write your answers in is by clicking on the T text box. If you want, you can change the color to make it stand out a little bit. So one more than 452 would be 453. Now that's pretty big. I want to make it fit in the box. So I am just going to click on it and make it a little smaller and then slide it right over into the box. And then I will do the same thing for all of the others. When I'm done, I will go ahead and click on the green check mark. And that turns the assignment in. Simple as that. Let me know if you have any questions. Otherwise, have fun doing a little place value review.